Hi guys, it's Aaliyah. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm coming on again today to share another um, Etsy shop that I received an order from. Um, oh, actually it came today or yesterday. I can't remember. And I know I just did a video for an Etsy, so Etsy shop share for Flutter by Books. And I was trying to attach the her... Um, link to her Etsy shop in the description box and it didn't work every time I would click on the link it went to just basically my um kind of my home page on Etsy so unfortunately it didn't work I want to see maybe if I don't know I'm gonna have to think about that but in the meantime I want to share this that I got and again I wrote it the Etsy shop down on the um, envelope it's called dark woods sanctuary and a lot of the time from her I get um, coffee dyed papers because I like the way she coffee dyes her papers so I get that from her but when I was on there last time I saw this really neat kits or th well this kit um, that she has and it's basically kind of like let me just show you and I think she was calling it kit of the month and it's like a, a color theme so as you can see it's April oh this is for me hold on sorry didn't realize that was in there uh, I'll read that sorry because that she she um, wrote a little letter so I don't want to sit here in silence but <laughs> um, so yeah so basically what it is is it's kind of like sorry about the glare it's a color coordinated kit so this one that i chose was yellow so she has actually let me take it out of the package um because the glare is just so glary is that even a word the glare is glary <laughs> but what i want to do is oh no oh no come out please What I, my intention was, was to create a journal with all of this, just with this, and have it like a yellow journal. Um, and then here's some like coffee dyed stuff. I think this came with it, maybe? Or did I, you know what? I can't remember if this came with it or maybe I ordered it. I don't know. <laughs> but... <laughs> I don't know, that just threw me off. I want to say it does come together, actually. Hmm. But either way, you can go to her shop and check out the kits that she has, um, and I'm sure we'll give all the information in her description. So we have, look it, we have the baby tags, and then let me see if I can get one out. So see how it's like kind of like dipped in um, yellow. So there's the baby tags and then the big tags. So here's your tags for the journal. Next we have, ooh, oh, I don't know what kind of paper this is, but it has a really nice crinkle. I love that sound. <laughs> so these would make really nice, um, well, pages, but you could also make envelopes out of it, or you can decoupage it onto, like, the napkins or something. I mean, um, like a napkin, you could decoupage it onto a tag. So it comes with that, and then here are some doilies, and of course, you know, always use doilies. And then these look like possibly coffee filters, maybe? And they're all yellowed. So those, excuse me, are perfect. And then what do we have here? These are, oh, envelopes. Okay, yes. So there's envelopes. And then these are bigger envelopes. Okay, see, the flap is there. So this is the pile of envelopes. And then we have some like regular note paper, which would be nice as small pages or nice to fold up and put in pockets. So there's some of those. And then here are the, kind of like the, um, 
Oh, I thought these were like message pads, but it's not. It's like from an address book. Oh, can you see that? I don't even know. So it has the name, address, home number, office number, cell phone, fax, email. Oh, so front and back is actually the same. So that is that. And actually, it would be kind of neat. Cut it apart, cut each section apart, and then um, kind of back it onto maybe a harder cardstock and use it as like a tag. That'd be an idea. And then here are, so we have some, this is plain, um, it looks like it's, it's heavier printer paper. I know she dyes a lot of her stuff, um, like the coffee dyed papers, on a heavier paper. So it's not the regular 20 pound printer paper. I don't know if it's 24, maybe 24 pound because it is thicker. So we have some of the regular paper. Then we have some line paper. And then we have the graph paper. So all different kinds of papers in there. Yeah, that's not going back on right now. <laughs> so that's all the yellow. And then let's just take a look at this. And this is the coffee dyed stuff. You know what, now that I think about it, I think this, it did came with a, um, with a packet. So, this stuff is all, oh, I love these. And it's the real, like, the thick, um, the real ones, really. Um, the ones that you would find in the library book. So there's some of those. And then here, um, I've actually ordered these from her before. Um, they're all different size index cards and I know they're index cards cause I can faintly see that top red line, but I know because she has packs of index cards that she's coffee dyed and dip dyed and other dyed. She's like the master of dyeing stuff. So if you're looking for anything coffee dyed, color dyed, go to her shop. She has lots of it. So there, okay. So you can make tags of this actually it would be kind of neat to try to take the, um, the this paper here and try to decoupage it onto one of the one of the cards so that's an idea so there's the index cards then we have oh this is like notebook paper kind of yeah Let's see so that's really cool because i like using full pages like this when I'm doing my journals and I can't get that back on right now. And then we have this, which is more of that paper, like the yellow paper. Oh, I absolutely love it. Listen, I love that sound. And actually it's already cut down to size. I would just have to trim it a little bit. So these are ready to go. And then of course, regular coffee dyed paper. And it is the thicker paper. I think it's 24 pound that she uses. So I like it because it's not so thin like 20 pound paper. So that is everything I got from her shop. She is absolutely wonderful. She has all this different dyed, um, basically it's like dyed ephemera, dyed paper. Um, and it comes in different packs too, or it comes like plain. Like a lot of times I'll order just a package of um, coffee dyed paper. So it's all just coffee dyed paper. But she does have other package, uh, packages, I could say, that are like mixed. So like the index cards will have, you know, a mixture of them. Um, but I've never seen, and I'm sure there's other people out there, I just personally myself have never seen um, all the different colors that she dyes her papers. And the dip dye is different than dyeing. And I don't know if that makes sense. Um, like these here, they're all dyed. They're all like one color. But kind of see how this is, you can see the white in the middle and then around it's colored. She does other things like that too, which is really, really neat. So definitely give her um, shop a look. Let me... Put it up here again dark woods sanctuary and again i don't know if i think you have to type it all one word capital w capital s sometimes if you don't do it exactly like it is it doesn't come up but it, if i can put links to these videos i'm making below i definitely will but you got to check her out it's super cool stuff that she has at her shop so 
Um, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you go and check her out. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.